Alright, and welcome back to my playthrough of Digimon All-Star Rumble for the PS3 on Shoutmon's road to becoming to becoming the king. Uh-huh, I'm going, it's good to be the king. But no, I am loving, he fucking deserves it. I am loving Shoutmon so far. He is beast level, man. He is, I really, I really want to watch Digimon Fusion now. Welcome to the third battle stage, Factory Town. This place is not as busy as it was in the past, but it is but it used to be a highly active industrial town. There are a lot of traps and machines all around, so be careful. Good luck. Good luck to you too, my little furry friend. But no, I then again it's funny. Dissidia made me want to play ended up making me want to play Final Fantasy IX just because just because Zidane was like my favorite character in in Dissidia. And who do we got? Uh, eh. Got a Vimon card. Neat. But, no, it turned. Zidane was like my favorite character there, so, by the way, new. Oh, yeah, it's Goblimon. You'd think I would know by now. Hey, it's Goblimon. It's not a very strong Digimon, but they can get out of hand in numbers. Yes, they can. Yes, they can. Until I do something like that and just fuck his shit up. Out. Get the hell out of here. But no, and it's funny, as it turns out, Final Fantasy VIII wasn't my favorite Final Fantasy game of the PS1 gen. It was actually dun 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 Final Fantasy VIII. Final Fantasy IX was second, but no, I fucking loved Final Fantasy VIII and sank so much time into that before beating it. It's I think I still have my save file on my Vita, too. Hmm, looks like this place is like a Goblimon nest. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And, what the? Uppercut. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, what, what? I say what, what? In the butt. I say, oh, we're gonna fight that dog thing, whatever. I don't know what the hell he is, or what season he comes from because Digimon Fusion was when I was at the start of college like what 2010 2011 is when Fusion came out so that was I think that was the other than the Digimon Try Adventures which I still really want to watch because if other people go to Mega and that that'd be awesome plus Digimon Adventure is probably my favorite out of Digimon with Digimon with Digimon Adventure 2 being the being the best one. To me, anyways. That's a lot of Gobblemon. Damn, and that was a good uppercut. Upper, upper Come here, boss. You dick. Don't you dare. Don't you put your hands on me. Get your, get your hands off me. Turtle! That's a Turtlemon. Things get out of control when it's spinning, so be careful. Digivolving against powerful enemies is a good tactic. When your EP gauge fills, press the R1 button and the L1 button at the same time. Don't tell me what to do! Oh, snap! Jesus! Yeah, his attacks are just way too fucking over the top powerful. I love it, my way fight on Friday night, Mago. Oh, uh, what can I do in the air? Some dash thing. Oh my god, that. No, seriously, I'm gonna say it over and over. Dorulumon. Reduce your opponent's. Oh, nice. Can be. And yet. Funny thing is, I can equip him with Shoutmon. I don't know. The rules of who can equip what are weird to me. I do like how every character has their own story and sort of mission, but. It's a case of, like, hopefully... I mean, there are a bunch of hidden characters that aren't unlocked yet. And the Digivolution pads only go with the Digimon, so... And I'm thinking... I'm thinking Shoutmon's gonna get his... Oh, look, Shoutmon. Oh, hey, the Rulamon. As powered as ever, I didn't know you were in this tournament. <laughs> I don't have time to make small talk with you. Come at me if you dare, Shoutmon. Ha, <laughs> no invitation necessary. Get ready, Darulumon. 
obviously, these two know each other. So, yeah. Neat. Oh god, and the damage race. Damn it, no. We're good. We're good. Oh, snap. That's how you... This is... Come on. Come on. Right into the uppercut. Right into the old pocket. Yes. Going to fuck your ass up, boy. I don't know if clicking all the buttons does anything different, but... It certainly feels like it does help. And, oh. You will live as you die in Nomamon. <laughs> yes. And I will make sure of it. Boom. I love... Okay, ever since discovering this cheap-ass move, I love it. It's so impossibly cheap. Okay, come on. Where you... <laughs> Down the hole with ya. Down the hole you go. Uh-oh. Uh, good. That does help. Just, you get the fuck away with that. What did he evolve into? What did he evolve into? Good, you, you just stay trapped. You just stay trapped. Thank you. Yeah, now you're dead, man. Fireball dance! Again, I, I keep saying it, Shoutmon, Shoutmon is so unspeakably broken. Ew, nice. He is just so unspeakably broken. I guess that makes up for his his lower HP pool is the fact that he's so much more beast level than Agumon and Gabumon combined. Sad part is I get fast ooh. <laughs> Here it comes. <laughs> Boom. Back the fuck up. Who told you to get in my face? Ow? Uh-oh, this is a problem. Okay, go down the hole, down the hole. Thank you, right in your old pocket. And I'm just gonna take the... I'm just gonna hold you in the sky until time runs out. I'm okay with this. I get it. It's so beyond cheap. Because shout my look at that! I killed him four times. That might be holy crap. That's actually a good chunk of bits that I picked up there from an early fight, no less. So you haven't lost your strength, Shoutmon. <laughs> Phew! That was a tough one, but I can't be stopped here. Not if I ever want to be a Digimon King. I wish you luck in your battles. Farewell, Shoutmon. What was that odd feeling? I sense something terrible in Shaomon's future. Must be my imagination. No, it's something. Something. Something bad's gonna happen. Something bad. Mm hmm. Something bad gonna happen. Mm hmm. Wait. Oh, I'm like, didn't I say yes? Oh, it's because. Because of things. I don't know. Uh huh. Basically, the reason I get that Rockstar vibe, though, is because the self-proclaimed Digimon can- Well, well, the tournament is steadily moving along. So far, it looks like Agumon, Gabumon, Gatumon, and a few other top contenders still remain. Who will win it all? Let's find out. Nimon signing out. But no, it gives me that vibe of the self-proclaimed Digimon King, Edamon, who, you know, is the Elvis kind of dude. He was, he was a it's funny though, he has, he's one of the three major villains before the Dark Master arc begins. And yet, when he comes back, wait, there's a path over here? Uh-oh. 
you... Well, you know what? This is new. Oh, well, that's new. Never been that way before. Huh, go figure. But no, it's funny how he's... Ow, what the fuck? I wasn't even under the shadow. I hate these things. Whoop! I forgot they actually come this way. And yet, I can do that and just be done with it. But no, like I'm, like I'm trying to say, though, it's funny how he was one of the three main villains before the Dark Master arc. So really one of the three main villains, period. And yet, he comes back during the Dark Master arc. It, it, his return's not even that important. Like, he's around for what? All of a couple of episodes until Saber Leomon kills him? It's a Cyclone Mon. It's a one-eyed dragon Digimon, or one-eyed Digimon that has a very strong right arm. The high-temperature fire it breathes from its mouth can melt anything. Be careful when you're fighting it. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Crap. I hate you. I hate you so much. I had it. Get down. Get up, get, get, get down, get your ass down. I can't tell who that is in the distance. It's a red Digimon, so, and I've already fought a Tentomon. Ooh, neat. Gardromon. But yeah, Metal, e Metal Edamon's return was kind of... Like, Edamon gets a whole big arc unto him. Wait, is that Gilmon? Neat! Haven't seen him yet. Maybe I should have written down who I've encountered so far, but nah. Yeah, all Digimon who made it this far, congratulations. We'll be having you all board the train-type Digimon Locomon to head on to the next stage. Oh, but only one Digimon from each pair will get a ticket to board. Good luck with the battle. <laughs> well, thank you. Yeah, definitely get a save, but... Yeah, Metal Edamon didn't really get that big of a return in, in the Dark Masters arc. He was sort of an afterthought, really, just to give them something to do. I would say the Myotis Monarch was probably one of the biggest ones, and in all honesty, one of the best. You're red. Me red. Red red. Killmon, play. Yeah, <laughs> man, you're something else. But I like it. The name's Shoutmon. Here I go, Gilmon. So we're both red, and we're both gonna fight, and... Oh, yeah, and with a time bomb. Bomb? Rope? Lanternoid? Bomb? I'm gonna fuck your ass up. Oh fuck you! Damn you! Damn you, Gilmon! Come here, boy! And getting them run over by the train means all of nothing. But getting them blown up by their bomb, yeah, now that means something. That means something special. I'm gonna keep your ass here down. I'm gonna keep your ass down here, though. Come on, boy. Come on. We're, we're staying down here, man. Oh. Oh, that's my Sophie Mon. Neat. Man, my cards are actually triggering a lot more often, it seems, which I'm totally fine with. Fine! Oh. Yeah, go ahead, grab that. That's the dumbest thing you could have done. <laughs> Come on! Yeah. Oh, that didn't hurt him. Lame. Oh, but his will go. Sorry, too bad, so sad, bye-bye. Ooh, slow-moving, gigantic smart bomb. Get him! Get him! Uh, oh, fuck shit. Ooh. I don't care.
I do not... So, a lot of these Digimon don't go to their Mega Form, though. That's actually really surprising. By the way, I think that was the first time as Shoutmon that I dropped a fall. And all because of a bomb. All because of a fucking bomb. It wasn't even because of anything else. But no, because of a rope. Landon oil. Bomb. Wow, yeah. Gilmon can... Oh, nice. Darn, you look young. But you got some serious chops. But I still won. Sorry about that, Gilmon. Gilmon lose. Shoutmon strong. <laughs> Thanks, man. Best compliment ever. Just keep training with the shout of my soul in your mind. Awesome. Yeah, we destroyed Gilmon, and do we go to the... I always forget if there's going to be dialogue or not. But the only dialogue that's going to happen here is the dialogue where we end the episode. So, in the meantime, go check out what our friends are up to. And until next time, as always, thanks for watching.